Hi, my name is Jonathan Giles. I am a comedian here in Chicago. And for the next three days, I will be participating in the food dessert challenge. What? It's not, it's not dessert? De desert? What do you, hold on, give me that. No, I was in the same meetings as you. There was a pie chart. They said pie, I started thinking apple. Hi, my name is Jonathan Giles. I will be participating in the food desert challenge. It's not a dessert challenge, it's a desert challenge. Food deserts is actually is a very, very serious thing. They, uh, food desert is um, places in certain communities where they don't have access to the type of food that um, people like myself, or if you're watching this video, you may have access to the food that's nutritious, food that they need just to live healthy lives. Think about kids who might be on reduced um, food lunches. Think about kids who may be getting free lunches at their schools, but during the summer, where do they, where do they go get lunch? Um, well, they're probably shopping at corner stores, convenience stores, bodegas. So for the next three days, I'm gonna be uh, about that life. Okay, so we are on the uh, hunt for some food. I was hoping to get some bananas because um, I figured, you know, I could eat like a banana for breakfast, but they didn't have any fruit besides lime. I decided very quickly I wasn't going to be able to spend $5 each day. So I decided, let me see if I can buy maybe better foods for myself, but stretch that money over the next three days. So we were able to get some bread. We also decided to get some cheese. Might make, make, make some of my famous grilled cheese sandwiches that, you know, I'm so well known for. All right, this is breakfast. Day one was not too bad. So I had bought bread, cheese, and eggs. So the bread cost me about two bucks. Cheese cost me three. Uh, eggs cost me three. So I spent a little bit over $8, but I got you know, the bread, the cheese, and the eggs will last me for probably these three days. I, yeah, I don't know. I I woke up this morning, had a little bit of a headache, but I don't, you know, it's like a weird headache. Like, I would like to eat something different besides bread and eggs. That'd be nice. It's uh, about the middle of day two. I'm, uh, I'm out in the search of uh, a late lunch, I guess. I've had just about as much eggs as I can eat for a day and a half. I think there's like a uh, Spanish marketplace on the corner up here. I have six dollars left so I gotta remember that. I'm out again. I tried to get something to eat earlier because I was getting a little irritated. I went into this little corner market. There's corner markets on my street. I'd never been into them before but they actually had a lot of options. But the food costs so much. Remember, I only have six dollars left on my uh, on my budget, and they actually had fruit, which is a good option. They had like bananas and oranges, but they're like a dollar a piece. I have ninety nine cents for a banana. Like I could buy bananas for thirty nine cents a pound, like at the regular grocery store. But these places, like, because they don't have a lot of food in bulk, you got to pay a lot of money for it. Bologna cost me about four dollars. So that leaves me with three bucks. Day three, I am, well, I'm about to eat breakfast. I'll just show you. Yep, more <laughs> eggs and toast. I don't, I don't know if I could eat this every day. Fourth of July weekend, there's probably people who can't even enjoy, really enjoy like holidays, cause you know, they don't have as much access to stuff as everyone else. Or the food that they get probably isn't that great. Like you think about it, it's probably a lot of communities you know, just have inadequate resources. Like even yesterday, I could just feel my brain didn't want to work the way it should because, you know, I was just like tired, sluggish, I was hungry. I was at the gym, so I had done some cardio and um, I was getting ready to lift. Then I did like 30 minutes cardio and then I lifted for like 10 minutes and like 10 minutes in, I just started feeling real, real dizzy. So try to make sure I got plenty of fluids in me. Uh, just drink some, a lot of water. I don't know, I may lay down for a bit, just kind of close my eyes. I'm, my head's kind of messed up right now, so I don't, I don't know, I'm probably talking nonsense. So just, uh, it's, not, it's not a good feeling. 